All right, guys, this is the AAC Illusion 9, and the key feature of this one is actually the offset bore. So similar to Sound Chico's Osprey, um, they have a offset bore, but that that comes in more of a rectangle shape. And me personally, I'm, I'm not used to that shape on as a suppressor, and, and it doesn't work with all guns. It works with some of those uh, some guns that that fit that that blocky profile and I think it works well with those but the majority of firearms doesn't actually work well with that that design like this Beretta right here would not look uh, aesthetically good with the uh, Osprey attached to the front end that's just my opinion but um, everybody has their own personal preferences on, on how things look personally I don't think it would look well this is a advanced armaments offering it does a similar thing it allows you to have a normal uh, sight height instead of having a suppressor height sight and still be able to uh, look over top of the uh, suppressor so the good thing is you can index the uh, if you're looking down the, the sights you can index the suppress suppressor so it actually lines up where you need it to so if you thread your suppressor on and it threads on like this and the bore let me show it to you right this way and the bore is off a little bit you can index the bore to where you need it so it lines up correctly and just you can feel it pulling on the piston there's a spring in there the piston spring is in there and just adjust the uh, suppressor where you need it index it where you need it and then you can check it and make sure it's aligned with the bore I need to come over a little bit and that should be it so like I said, this is a pretty compact suppressor. Uh, sound suppression is pretty good when compared to other uh, nine millimeters. I, I really couldn't tell the difference uh, with some of the other ones I shot. So they're all pretty much running around the same um, average decibels of what they're reducing for, for your hearing. So it's hearing safe. I shot it with subs, 140 grain uh, subs, and everything ran fine. It's very reliable, no issues. I shot it here with the Beretta. and it ran fine. This is the first time I actually shooting the Beretta as a, as a host. So I wanted to see how that ran and, and the suppressor worked well with it. Also shot it with uh, the Glock and same thing, no issues. So ideally I would like to break this uh, suppressor down like I do in the other videos. But um, I wasn't afforded the tool to actually take down the piston end of the suppressor. And the other end is kind of uh, caked up a little bit. So I'll try to provide a video of the um, picture or a link to a video of the internals. I should mention this, uh, the baffles itself is 17-4 uh, stainless steel and the um, suppressor itself is a nitrite coated. Thanks for watching the channel as usual. Thank you.